Hey guys, it's Alon, and welcome to part two of Minecraft biomes as they should look, and a series in which I showcase the biomes that I built by hand in my Minecraft creative world. And today I'm going to be showing you guys the Mesa biome, which you can see in the background over here. And right now I am in the second port city in my world, but let's, but let's but without further ado, let's head straight into it. So here we've got or one of our Mesa mine shafts. I originally intended for this to actually be a functioning mine shaft, but but just before I started recording this, I actually made it instead look old and abandoned. Like maybe it's the first mine shaft that the people that built the second port city created in, in, when finding gold or something. Anyway, anyway, you've got a plateau right here. And I didn't, of course, I didn't add the terracotta layering right here. But now, let's head into this desert-like area of the biome, where we've got a lot of dead bushes, cacti, and even some patches, of course, certain tall grass. Oh, my. Why is my game lagging? Why is my, oh, my game is actually starting to lag right now, for some reason. I don't know. Anyway, so we got, so we're here. We have you have a little valley where the two where the two plateaus actually meet, and we've got an overhang right here. And we've got an overhang right here. And for whatever reason, my game is really starting to lag. I don't know if because of some process taking over my computer as I'm recording, or it's just because of the recorder itself. Anyway, we've got a anyway we've got a little spire, a couple of spires right here, sort of similar to the which are sort of similar to the Shatter Bandlands biome. And we have an incline here, which leads to the is us to the Mesa biome village that I built over here. So this so this is my concept of a village in a Mesa biome or a Badlands biome. Very hot. Here I have a I have several houses built into a cliff. And I only built the interior of one of them really, which is right here. And, and here's another ha and here's another house. We got a red one, we got a pink one, we got a white one with some logs sticking out and but and buttons. Down below, here, a yellow one. And the entrance to this house is actually right here. And once again, I haven't really built the interiors of of these houses yet, but we've got like an outdoor seating area up here. And this will be the interior of the house, like sort of like a balcony. Except there will also be a room below, I think, in the finished build. And over here we've got a rather a rather cool looking archway. Hey. Airplane. I don't know if you guys can hear it. Now, so let's head over to the other side of the plateau here, and into our and into our custom wooded Badlands Plateau biome. So so this is basically supposed to resemble a, a dying forest on top of the Mesa Plateau. Like you can tell, like, like you can tell from all the vines that I put in the tree here and the general just and the general just dry and pale look of the grass and leaves in the Mesa biome. And I put some dead bushes and tall grass down here. And I detail and I also detailed the ground with coarse dirt and grass path blocks. All right. And, over, and behind this plateau here, we've actually got a canyon. And this is actually not even entirely finished. It's, uh, it's redundant once again. I love that. But we have... But I have added a little detail to the side down here, and I and I actually I'm almost and I actually almost entirely built a bridge right here. I just missed this. I just haven't built the supports yet. And and now let's head over to our little station from when I was actually working in this canyon and update the map right here. Bam! It actually didn't even show all the all of what I built. There, that's much better. Love seeing, I love updating the map and seeing the dramatic change. There. Now it is about to turn night here. And we will wrap things up in just a little bit. 
But at first, I'm actually going to show you guys the transition I put here from the Mesa into the desert. Of course, I'm on autopilot, it's called the Mesa, even though it's Badlands now. So instead of the jarring transition of vanilla worlds, I actually created a roughly 16 or 17 or 18 block transition from the desert into the mesa biome here where these where we where the amount of red sand gradually increases as we get in, as we move further in and the regular sand gradually thins out as we move closer to the mesa biome so so yeah guys that's pretty much all I've got for today. If you want to check this and the rest of my map out for yourself, the download is in the description below. I will update it after this recording. And leave a like if you enjoyed. And consider subscribing to my channel if, if you haven't already. And hit the bell and click all for all notifications. Goodbye.